welcome back to my channel, The Boys, Season 2, Episode 4, right? Mm -hmm. We're on yeah, 4? Episode 4. Um, okay, I don't really want to talk, like, for that so long yes. before we get into okay. Go ahead. the episode. <laughs> so, um, last episode, kind of a shocker. Yeah, the last, like, 15 minutes. Front. Stormfront just killing a bunch of uh, civilians. She's just a piece of shit. Yeah, and then uh, now we got pretty much Butcher and Huey on the same page again. Which is good. Which is good, so it seems like the boys are finally... The boys, I wouldn't they're e back yeah, together. I wouldn't even say level-headed, because Kamiko is kind of like... Oh, Kamiko is going through it Yeah, because her brother, like... It wasn't even like a death where it's just like really quick. She broke his hand, broke Stormfront. His, his power, kind of like how Homelander did it to that one bl uh, deaf you're guy. Right, you're right. Or blind guy. You're right. That used his ears. Deaf guy. And he was deaf. No, he was blind and he made him deaf because oh, yeah, he had yeah, 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 right, like super right, right. hearing. So it was kind of like the same thing. You take away their power before you end up killing them. Which so it's, like, it's yeah, not it's even a mercy up. kill. It's like like the worst death that you could have. Because we were both uh, fans of Stormfront. I mean, I still am. I mean, she's a great character. Yeah. But fans of her is in the way that like she was going against Vought. Yeah. But now it's like she just says. Everything it seems like she just does not give up. Yeah, a fuck. I'm rooting for her in the sense of like her taking down Vought and maybe not giving a shit. But mm -hmm. after the last episode, it's kind of hard to root for her after that. If she killed Kamiko, game over. Oh, yeah. It would have yeah. been. It would have been. I mean, it was still sad that it was Kamiko's brother, but we didn't know him that was, much. And he was. He was. Like not really on their side. Yeah, like, it's he more kept trying to escape. Yeah. He kept trying to get out there. It's so. more sad seeing. Uh, uh, Kamiko's reaction, yeah. and knowing that Frenchie wanted to learn the language, yeah. the sign language, and maybe he maybe he would have died anyway if he was given to Mallory. That's true too. Butcher, That's true too. Or they just would have taken him into custody. I don't know what they would have done to him, but. but now, um, so now they lost their ticket for Mallory. So now they're kind of just back to square back one, to right? Squ literally back to square yeah. one, unless Starlight could help out some. But she can't even help because now she needs to stay on the DL with, home, yeah, cause home with Lander, Homelander and A-Train. The only thing she did was the whole thing with uh, exposing Vought. Yeah. But even now, uh, Stan came up with the excuse, an excuse. I don't know if the excuse is going to hold up. Yeah. Then the stuff with Maeve with Homelander. And oh then, yeah, I forgot about yeah, that. Yeah. So Homelander, like he heard their conversation. He probably knows that she has some type of relationship with her. Which, why would he even, why like, would care? Why would he care? Because like, it seems like their relationship was for show anyways, yeah. the way that Maeve was talking about mm -hmm. it. So, the same way that Star it seems like Starlight and Homelander have a I mean, relationship, probably. Maeve, Maeve might be scared that he might do something to Elena, right? Yeah. Maybe, I don't just think he the, would just kill Just that her. knowledge in the yeah. future, you wouldn't want to but Maeve get never on really, his bad side. Maybe, Maeve never got never, on his bad yeah, side. Yeah, never really disobeys. Because she knew. She knows her place, yeah. and she knows not to, like, ruffle any feathers. She kind of just, like, sticks in, yeah, in her exactly. box. When Stormfront's, like, the quit opposite. Where yes. She'll talk back to Homelander like it's nothing. Right, because she has the backing yeah. of Edgar, though. Yeah, that's true. So, and then the stuff of Becca and the son. Yeah. Where the son's defending the mo his mom, and uh, that kind of, like, was a whip like a wake-up call to Homelander because yeah. it's like the first time somebody actually said like no to him and it's his own child yeah. so that's gotta hurt and then what we also forgot to mention in the recap of the last episode was that yeah. dialogue between Becca and Homelander where it was like you uh where he was like you wanted this but then she was oh, like no right. you made like you know what we I mean did, yeah we didn't yeah. mention that so he she said what did she say I he said, said you wanted this he, I think he said yeah I gave you the, you wanted the a son and I gave it to you or something like that yeah. But then she was like, she said I didn't, something. I didn't want I didn't like, like, like the way yeah, it happened something. or something. So I don't know. Something I don't know who's telling the truth. Yeah, it alluded to the fact that maybe the story is she didn't want it in the first place. Maybe she just made a mistake, and she didn't want the baby. She didn't want a soup baby. She didn't want a soup baby. Especially she a thought it would, maybe, baby. maybe she thought it would kill her, and then it would give her away to yeah. to butcher. So Vought was like, "You need to have this baby, maybe," and. She said, well, then I can't be with Butcher. I can't, like, see him anymore, so I need to kind of go into yeah, this witness might, protection. They might force, there might be, like, there's probably situations where other mothers where they know they're having a soup baby but don't want to, yeah. but they probably force them to do it. Oh, because they pay them more off. They said, yeah. that, they said that last episode. They yeah. pay all the parents they off. Pay the, yeah, but I'm saying there's probably some parents that, like, legitimately don't want don't to do want it. Don't want to have a soup and, baby. And, yeah, so it's like, they, yeah, like you said, they either buy them off or they just force them through threats. Yeah. Because, I mean, if someone, if somebody like Homelander threatens you to have a kid, yeah, but I'm they not going to say they no. don't give them Compound V when they're pregnant, though. Oh, yeah, that's true. It's after when they're, because we saw that with, when he, he had so, the baby and he was... 
Okay, wait, so then, so Homelander, so Homelander and Becca's was, kid. Wasn't Homelander, like, the blueprint? He was, like, maybe the first, or no, he wasn't the first soup ever. No, I don't think what so, What makes no. him so special, then? He's just the most I mean, powerful just like, one? just, yeah, like, Superman, basically. But um, my question is, if, if, if Becca, like, Becca and Homelander's kid, right. so he wasn't born with those powers, he was given Compound V? Or if you're a soup he, baby, you're, no, you're he automatically was born. He, was, he, was, he is a special case, though, because the, it was Homelander's DNA soup DNA that mm-hmm. he was born with. Mm. So he was born with it, yeah. but not every kid is like that because okay. they're a result of two humans. You know like, what I mean? Like, remember the one kid that had the, uh, from the first season that had the little laser eyes, the little baby? Yes. So that, that baby... Was, that was the injection of compound. So that, had, so that baby the had ba- The baby was not born like that. The baby was injected because well, yeah. these are regular families. It's not like soup families. You know what I mean? So, but, but I'm saying like, my question is... If, if two soups had like a No, baby? no. If a soup and a normal have a baby... Does that baby automatically have powers? Or no? I don't know. I, I don't know, know about yeah, that. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know because the only case that we've seen so far to go off is yeah. Becca. Because I obviously know that two normal people, their baby has to be injected with it. The compound right. V. That's right. obvious. And I just don't suits, know. It would probably, It'd probably be, be a 100% percent yeah, yeah. Those are all our thoughts. And without further ado, let's get into episode four. Oh. Oh. I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. I was just. Not the right time, man. <laughs> Brother just died. There you are. Madeline. What? I, <laughs> I was beginning to worry. Is he tripping? I don't know. Does she have a twin? Does she have a twin? I don't think so. The fuck? He oh, killed, we on. saw him kill I've her. You. It's a dream. It's a dream. It's a dream. So I want to see that. Are you thirsty? More milk? <laughs> <laughs> so. Wait, wait a second. What? I think I know who it is. Who? I think I know who it is. There's a hero that. The this, morph? The morph yeah, guy? The, yeah, I think it's him. It's gotta Why be. Why would it be him, though? Was, was he the one that was giving the presentation? No, he was an older guy, wasn't he? What do you mean? I'm trying to think of who the morph guy was because we I saw was him morph. Second to your suit, active in the 70s. She was all over Susan's private oh, server. Yeah, another mission. Marvin to talk to the celebrity. They're going to have to live with What? Or at least our best guess where she is. We had a deal. That didn't come through. Jesus, but I'm just giving it to you. It's my fault you stopped searching for her. He didn't. She doesn't know. Does she know that? Oh, it's our taxi driver. Yeah, you're right. Oh, I thought it was. Oh, yeah. back. Yeah. I'm sorry. I killed the whole shape for so long before it really works. That's okay. Come here. That's so it's weird. Okay. That is weird. Oh, my little boy. Come How do you do that? My knowing, little boy. Knowing that there, it's not her underneath and all that. It's okay. She's like the least of his concerns right now, though. Come on. Yeah, emergency stop. Oh, what is happening? No more lies. God. I'm not with him. Damn, he's talking back but to Homelander. you want to kill me because I'm not a murderer and I won't straight up execute someone, then go ahead. So tell me, am I lying? Oh! Damn. He's like, in that case. I'm <laughs> not lying. She really is taking like a page out of Stormfront. Just, just, she's just a page. Like, yeah, <laughs> just a page, not the whole book. <laughs> if we're gonna go knock on some soup store, don't you think it makes a little bit of sense for us to have one of our That's true. She needs this. So we got a new member of the boys. I mean, she kind of was like the she was unofficial, unofficial member, sure. yeah. Who is this? Oh, the guy that he burst in the race, maybe? Oh, yeah, I think it is. Chocolate yeah. is just here to talk about Bot for Tots. I swear to God. Well, shit, I fucking love fat kids. Who's <laughs> me? Good, you're here. Hey, Train, you can't run. Yes, I can run. I just... I, I just... Buddy, it's your heart. You can see you that can tell, shit. Yeah. I doubt you're even cracked in the top 20. Yeah. You know, so you're going to be going against... They're, they're dropping, like, yeah. flies. Does anyone mind if I want some music? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> you have a really good voice. <laughs> You've got to be station? <laughs> 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 I thought it was going to 
suicide, what is this shit? <laughs> My mom never let me have this stuff, but my dad, um, he'd take me to Dunkin' on the slide, and he would get me a chocolate cream-filled donut, and he'd ask me to tell him about my day. My pops, he'd always ask for samples. There'd be a line all the way out the door. People would be mad as hell. Yelling, cussing, no mom, man. Of course, now I give a year off my life just to be able to see that man going through spoon after spoon just one last time. To fathers and sugar. To fathers and sugar. I like that. Yeah, that's nice. Unexpected. Oh. Any place around here <gasps> of how many body cameras. Damn. So I guess he just found out where the cameras guess, were yeah. and went. Just avoided them? Yeah. I mean, it's a lo very large area yeah. from what we've seen. Like, what's up, man? I want like a, what's yeah, going I want like on? a straight up explanation. Like, everything she does, I'm analyzing mm -hmm. because I don't know anything about her. Yeah, okay. Didn't hurt you. Who could even find him? I said if he hurt you, I would kill myself in front of Ryan. Damn. And my last words would be your father did this to me. It's crazy. Yeah, I know. Wait here. I'll be back. Okay. I mean, she probably is going crazy too. No social interaction. Nobody to talk to. Nowhere to go. Is that an almond joy? Mm hmm. Nobody likes almond joy. What? Yeah, I don't like it either. Well, I can't have Jeffrey it. I can't have it. <laughs> Charleston Chew. Is that a real thing? And Bit O Honey. Jesus Christ. Charleston shoes are good too. Yeah, I've never heard of the worst candy bars in the history of candy. It's like yeah. marshmallow inside. Yeah. Like it's cool. like old school candy, yeah. but it's good. Just, just have a Twix. Hey, what's up with MM's OCD? Hey, what, what OCD? Oh my god! That was, I, that was so good. That was really good. <laughs> How long have you been here for that, I? Since I gave birth. Forget about me. Eating the news or smoking pot on the couch and eating Cheetos. Oh, they don't <laughs> I just asked that. Yeah, terrified of the radio all day. How have you been? I was in a whale a few days ago. <laughs> Stunned a private security company. I'm gonna make it up to you from now to the day I die, I swear to God. I mean, do you buy her story? 100%? Look at her face, I don't know. It uh, looks like she's kind of like... Uh, I don't know. Conflicted? Uh, hard to read. Like... M.M. knows. M.M. woke up, he's like, oh, here we ain't here. We have a gay hero. Oh, he's gonna out her on TV. Really? No. Queen Wave. Oh. Mm-hmm. Scoop for you, Maria. That's so right. embarrassing. So <laughs> Strong, proud lesbian with a beautiful girlfriend. That is why so does he care so much? Girlfriend. And I, for one, am so proud. Oh, why, why, why does he care so much? What did you do to him? Why is What? She's so, so weird. Just what did I do to her? I set her free. Oh, is it so hard to believe that I want you two to be happy? Honestly, my if I am really, really <laughs> happy for you. Damn. Uh oh, Super terrorist Nico. has already gotten through. No. Oh, no. <laughs> and it's all Nico. Nah, she's not gonna do it. She'll go crazy. She'll kill this whole crowd. Oh, Frenchie, you go. He's. You will not survive. She can. Whoa! Oh, she can fucking fly. Yeah, so she pretty much is like Homelander. My father was a lawyer. But see, Clark wasn't about to let this one black man put his foot on their necks. Mm -hmm. My father never gave up. Until one morning I woke up and I didn't hear those keys anymore. Yeah. That's why he just found watched over that typewriter dead at 55. He won't tell you that his Seems like he didn't even know that. Got passed down to me. Yeah, we're getting a lot of yeah. their why they joined the boys. For what they did. I was 11 years old. See in the back seat of my folks Ford. My brother and I were he was driving. Just looking fast. Jesus. A lot of these soups are racist. I mean, they work. Jesus. <gasps> that is so fun. <laughs> I was not <laughs> expecting that. That's bad. 
They thought it was pointless. How do you live after seeing so that? So when Jesus. that man from Vaughn, when he showed up and he offered us that money, we just took it. Nobody's seen her since 1979. I mean, she's probably dead by now. We didn't see her face either, no. so maybe they want us to think it's someone that we've already been introduced to. I mean, right? I mean, no one of the races we know is Stormfront. That's her. Yeah. Unless that was her before, I don't know. That could have been her. That's the difference. Told you, I called it. And the man makes Stormfront like what, like 70 years old? She doesn't age. But who knows what compound they can do. That's crazy. I mean, Vought was founded by a Nazi. By a Nazi. Say the I mean, <laughs> well, bitch. Jesus, that's pretty funny. <laughs> it's funny because he's getting would, so upset yeah, about it. Not only that, people would make shit like this. Of course. This reality. Damn. He really does Who not the like fuck her. Do you think you are? Uh oh. This constant need to be loved by everyone is kind of pathetic, but um, yay. <laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> I built this team from the ground up, and there is no fucking way that anyone is going to take it away from me. I mean, who would you rather have in the face? $273 million dollars on that saving America guys. bullshit, and I am running circles around you. You don't need 50 million people to love you. You need 5 million people fucking pissed. You just need a little help connecting with your audience. You know, change with the times. God knows I... Uh-oh, she's kind of... A little hint. Yeah. You were always one one bad day away from pounding someone to death in a parking lot. It's not true. Truth Good. Comes out. He raped me. Uh -oh. And when I found out I was pregnant, I went to Vaughn. I didn't come to you because I was scared. I love you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Now what? He has to find a way to get her out. I can be whoever you want. It's gonna make her be Stormfront so yeah. we can punch the shit out of her. <laughs> I don't need anyone but myself. Oh. <laughs> That's quite a sight. What's gonna happen here now? Like what you see. <laughs> see how hot you are? Hmm? That's great. That's crazy. Come on. I'm gonna suck your cock so fucking hard. Likes that shit. He I mean, likes I, himself I, so it's much. It's not even gay. Cause it's yourself. It's so, so weird. Oh. You're Shit in the first well, that season. That was it. Damn. Damn. Yeah, he was doing the black. So we have like five minutes or something. Let's see. Six. Okay. Six. Okay, that's enough. All right. So let's quickly talk about the episode because my camera is gonna run out of storage. But um, okay. So my main takeaway was the Liberty Stormfront thing because I called it. You called it. But you, you it, said it was pretty. It was pretty like obvious because we heard thing. and also her voice sounded pretty similar and the racism thing and also. They were purposely not showing her face, and I was kind of like, "This is somebody who, we know. Yeah, who is yeah. somebody that we know that they that can you know, this role. a new a new character that was introduced that would be it would be an interesting reveal." So but I think fun. she's I think she's the first soup that we know that uh, doesn't age. Yes. Or like so like, but when we she don't know we don't yeah. know the the story about. We it. don't know when she stopped aging. We yeah. don't know if she had the powers of Stormfront when she was Liberty. Yeah. Like, we don't know what her story well, is. Well, it's clear that she's Edgar's like. In Edgar's pocket, kind yeah. of their like their Edgar's. tool, and it seems like back in the seventies, she was just like this racist, basically corrupt. Like they were going around just killing people because they could, and it seems mm -hmm. like that's kind of slipping back into. Well, it. That, yeah, that mentality is definitely still there with her. And if you noticed, the people mm -hmm. that she killed in that apartment were complex were all black. Yeah. yeah. So, she's basically a racist. Which is interesting. I didn't know they would do something like that. That's, it's very, um, how do I say this what? without, like, offending anybody? It's very relevant to the times, mm -hmm. I feel. Like, I feel like they're definitely trying to make a statement. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, definitely. And also, we got a lot of imagery, like, with the Homelander Confederate flag thing. Yeah, I forgot That was happening. That. So it seems like... In North Carolina. It seems like these people, like, are just... They're, like, the image of America... Well, they did the whole thing, and remember when it was, like, you want it to be, uh, like, Homelander saves the world, or Homelander saves America. Saves America, and he wanted and yeah, it to be America. Yeah, so he's so. very much about America, and people might use that as an excuse to, like, I wouldn't even say he's racist. racist. I wouldn't even say he's racist, though, Homelander. You don't think... That we don't no, really have any reason to believe that. He's just a psycho. The only thing, well, the only thing was the when he was on the interview and she was like, "You don't have." Oh any, yeah. And he was like, "We have a train, you know." Like, yeah. And we yeah, have yeah, black people. That, that was another thing yeah. that was crazy when he outed me. Oh yeah, that shit's crazy. Like I don't know why so much he crazy. cares so much. Why does he care? I, he only cares because he never had that. No, because he wants everybody to love him, and the fact that she is going off with another person, and, it's, and, and she and, was yeah. supposed to be the person that was like with him since day one, loyal to him. I guess it's because of that. I, he just yeah. wants everyone to love him. It's probably yeah, probably too because he knows that the relationship she has with Elena is real. Yeah. And he knows that that relationship that she had with Homelander was, was fake. fake. You know, so he's probably he, like he doesn't really I have want a, some, Yeah, remember when he is at the end. He he's wants, like, I don't need anybody. Yeah. You know? You're right. So that's that's a good. Um, I think yeah, I think it's just like in the whole the mommy issues with Stillwell and now this with it never being in a real relationship. Yeah, but now now he's saying that he doesn't need anybody but himself. So what is that going to mean yeah, for the know. future episodes? He's know. kind of unhinged now. He told Stormfront that he was you know watch your back because I'm looking after yeah, you. Yeah, like I was the one that built this from the ground up yeah. and all that. I'm just I'm most curious about the Liberty thing because it seems like the boys are unraveling that now they have something to. To yeah. work with. It was also cool seeing uh, seeing Star uh, and then, Starlight become like the new member. Yeah, and, her and also milk. also seeing Mother's Milk's backstory on why he joined mm -hmm. the boys, yeah, why yeah, he yeah, wants yeah. to take down Vaught yeah. and Frenchie because Frenchie it was something with Lamplighter. Yeah, he must have felt bad. Maybe he somehow made that happen. But it's interesting to see how like. They didn't just join the boys because they wanted to. Like they all have reason. The only one we, the only one we knew was just butcher. And but butcher, yeah. We knew that and, already why he joined. Yeah. But and Huey obviously. And Huey, but, yeah. Uh, and then the whole thing with Kamiko, we. I mean, I I, I kind of I assume she wasn't gonna, gonna do anything. Do you think they're gonna have a showdown? Like? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know either. Let me see. All right, we got about a minute. So um, yeah, we had that, and then we had the stuff with the deep with picking a wife. Right, Which yeah. Which is with really the, weird. With like, the Scientology, yeah. basically. So I guess they're, like you said, they're probably trying to get him in the seven to, and then have him spread just his have ideology. that influence, right. That, exactly. I, I feel like it's very cut and dry with that. It's just they needed to get a storyline for him. Because they're going to, if somebody's in the but seven. But they're replacing A-Train now, or Homelander's talking yeah, about replacing A-Train, so. It's getting crazy. It is getting crazy. It's getting crazy. It's, it, it seems like. The but it seems like the whole Nazi thing is very relevant from what he was talking about yeah. with the history, and it seems like it's just kind of disguised in this modern day, this present day, what they're doing. Which is a lot. Which a lot is, of times you see now, you see companies that are inherently racist that just try to disguise yeah. it with with memes policies and, shit like and that, memes. Yeah. And it's it's very deep, but we'll talk more about it in our pre episode thought pre episode thoughts for next episode because my camera is running out of storage in about thirty seconds, so we're gonna wrap up our thoughts. As always, thank you guys for watching. Check out my other reactions if you have not already. And we will see you guys for episode five. All right. Bye, guys.